The Mali siege comes one week after terror attacks in Paris, attacks that have raised awareness and really heated debate over the future of 12 million Syrian refugees fleeing violence in their homeland. And it's not just Syria. All over the world, displaced people affected by conflict and persecution are at risk of becoming ill, malnourished, abused, or exploited. Denver 7 reporter Kristen Scovera spoke to the pastor of a local church who has been helping refugees. Father Andre Mahana is no stranger to the plight of refugees. Born in Lebanon, he grew up during the war. Sometimes to run for safety, we had to live in caves. Now, decades later, Father Mahana is a man on a mission, helping persecuted refugees from Iraq and Syria. The Catholic Church and the churches in general love to help. They never compromise. A refugee is a refugee. As the director of the St. Ralph Commission of Hope and Mercy, the churches help provide food, medicine, clothing, and hygiene supplies to hundreds of refugees since spring 2015. He thinks the church can do even more by helping the government. They have to utilize the local offices of the churches in Syria and in Lebanon, including the Catholic school systems or evangelical school systems, because we know how to identify the true refugees who are suffering from the possible people who are infiltrators. True refugees like this 19-year-old high school student from Iraq. We're not showing her face because she fears for her safety and that of her family back home. She told me relocating to the U.S. has been a blessing, but not without its own challenges. First, being away from my parents. Two, feeling very guilty. Those people are suffering while I'm living in peace. Third, the way people are looking at me. Still, she says it is the responsibility for everybody who runs away for safety from their lands of war to tell the story of the people inside there. Kristen Scovira, Denver 7. And Father Mahana wants to increase assistance to at least 1,000 more refugees, and this requires almost $200,000 for six months of support. We have more information on ways you can help on our website.